Morning sunshines. It's Thursday morning. You haven't seen us for three days. We have not put up a video for three days and I apologize. I really hate it. Um, but this weekend Dawson was hurt. He was in a hockey game and got checked into the boards and left the ice on a stretcher, went to the hospital. We thought he had a broken elbow and a broken wrist and we were worried also about a concussion. Um, but thankfully he only chipped the bone in his elbow and he's in a cast right now. His hockey season's over and he's devastated. Um, it's his family. It's where he goes every day. It's his life. He loves hockey. And to see that go away, he's going to miss the last two tournaments. He's just heartbroken. And he's gone to practice a couple days this week and just sat on the bench and watched them. And oh, he's just so sad. And then he's like grumpy because he's like, I can't sleep. It's hot in this cast. And, um, it's uncomfortable. And I think today he kind of is as accepted it and is kind of moving forward in his new normal but it's just it's just been a little sad so we haven't picked up the camera but today I am actually headed out to the mall um and I'm just I have some gift cards from Christmas and I just thought I want to get some things kind of in transition for spring and I desperately need a new pair of flats mine are, literally have a hole in them they're falling apart they're my favorite shoes and I don't want to get rid of them but it's time so I'm going to do that, and I thought I would bring you along. My friend Jacqueline's coming with me. I'm going to go pick her up in a minute, and um, I don't know if she's going to want to be on camera, so we'll see. And then I thought what I'd do is come home and unbag what I bought for you and do a try-on haul if I buy anything and then get the video out today. So come along with me to the mall, and let's see what we what trouble we can get into. Oh, my God. Oh my goodness, you guys. Look what Dawson got delivered. My dad and stepmom. Actually, it's my stepmom. My dad, I'm sure, knew, but she takes the lead on these things. Uh, got him this cookie bouquet. Look, there's a goalie and a, his jersey was 16 and a hockey puck. Another, or a hockey stick. That is adorable. He's going to be so excited because he's been so upset. Is that not the cutest cookie basket ever? I love it. He's going to be so excited. Aww. Let me choose and we're having a sale. Might need to try a few on. Look where I am. Wonder if I'm on anything. Might see a new video coming up for my stepping up your game. Can you guess what it might be? Okay guys, I'm back from the mall. I had so much fun. I did a little bit of damage, but I shopped sales and I had gift cards and so it's not as bad as it looks really. Um, that's what I keep telling myself anyway. I didn't shoot a lot in the mall because my friend was with me and I wasn't sure how she felt about filming. So anyway, let me just show you what I got and I'll try on the things that I have to try on also. So the first thing I got, I needed some flats. So I got these Lucky Brand flats. I actually have these same shoes in navy, but I love them. I love them. I wear the heck out of them. They're this just brown, simple ballet flat. They go with everything. I'll wear the heck out of them. And they, the color is Bourbon Winter Haze. I don't know. They were 50 bucks. Um, and actually, we went to the Lucky Store later, and they were 60 there. So these were $10 cheaper than the Lucky Store. So if you've never tried these flats before, I would highly recommend them. And also, just with a cute pair of like capri jeans or capri pants or whatever, a good flat, you'll just wear the heck of it in the spring. Then we um, were passing, as we were leaving, we found this boot sale. So I got these Gianni Beanie, I don't know this brand, but anyway, these boots were 80 bucks, marked down to $27.99. And I didn't really buy any boots this year because the ones I had from last year were still in pretty good shape. So I didn't really feel bad about buying these because the price was right. Like I said, $27.99. They're just a basic black boot. They have a little heel. They come up a little higher, which I don't have this style, but I love the buckle and the zipper on them. So like I said, for $27.99, I'll wear them a couple times, you know, through the rest of our winter in Georgia here, and then I'll have them for next year and they'll be in really great shape. So that was a fun find. I actually tried them on in brown and my friend tried them on in black. And I was like, ooh, I really want the black ones. And she didn't care if I did that. Then I went to, do you guys have a store called Altered State? I actually went to the store 
um, with my friend at the beach a couple years ago in Jacksonville, and I fell in love with this store, but we don't have one close. They are here in Georgia, but we don't have one close. So when I saw it in the mall, I made a beeline for it. And I've been looking for like necklaces that fit right here, like in between your collarbone, just really dainty, simple necklaces. And I actually had seen a necklace very similar to this that was 50 bucks. And I was just like, I can't spend 50 bucks for that. But I've been thinking about it and thinking about it. And I, I was like, maybe I'll go back and see if it's on sale. Well, I walked into this store and found almost the identical one that I've been looking for. It's the state of Georgia, because I'm Georgia Sunshine, for $14.95. Isn't that adorable? Just a really simple, it's kind of a hammered brushed gold. Really simple, it'll fit right here. I think with a cute t-shirt or collared shirt. I just think it's just a fun little novelty, cute little item. So then my friend had to go to mat, the mat counter because she had something to exchange. And so I was standing there, the lady's like, hey, you need help with anything? And um, I'd never tried mat makeup before, but I have really blonde brows and I've been feeling like I need to do something with them. And so I said, yeah, I want to do something with my brows. What do you want? Let's play. And she was like, yes, let's do it. So she put on this, um, it's the MAC Brow Duo, and it's actually the lightest color for brunettes, even though I'm a redhead, which was so funny. But it really looks good. It like matches pretty well my hair, the lightest color. And I actually think the darker color is going to look good on my daughter, so we can kind of share it. And then I got also, where is it? I lost my other thing. Oh, here it is. It's so tiny. I got like a little brow brush. Look how teeny it is, just to go up. Um, so I got that. So my first MAC cosmetics. I'm excited. I like it. Um, I kind of feel like every time I look in the mirror, my brows are like these two big caterpillars and they're so subtle. They really are. You can't really, can't really tell. But for me with such light eyebrows, um, that was funny, but I do like it. So the next thing I got, and I have to talk quietly because my daughter's just upstairs, but, um, for Valentine's day, I went into the Lush store and we've actually never been to Lush before. And I know it's really popular. It's something I wanted to do. We've actually been in the store, we've just never bought anything. So I got a couple of bath bombs. Like I got this Valentine one, it's got hearts, and these little hearts are essential oil. Oh my gosh, it smells like a sweet, I don't know, I got two of those, one for her and one for me. I don't know the names of some of these, honestly. I got this bubble bar, I think it's called, and you break it into four pieces. My daughter is like a sparkly fiend, so I thought this would be fun for her. And then I got... Um, what else? Oh, this is another one of the one with the hearts in it. And then I got, I don't know what this one is. It's very citrusy. I don't remember the name of it. It's just white. It doesn't I don't see anything floating in it, but there could be something buried in the middle. You know how lush is. And then I got um, this, I think it's called Intergalactic, maybe? Something like that. So I'm going to give that one to my daughter. And I got, what was the last one? Oh, this one was for me. It was, it's like a lavender bubble bar. And they said you could break these into four pieces. So they're great for four baths. It smells really good. Lavender is very calming. So I thought I would um, add that to her little Valentine gift. I don't really know what we're doing for Valentine's Day, but I figured instead of a bunch of candy, that might be fun. And then the last place we went was to the loft, A.M. Taylor Loft. I actually had a gift card from Christmas, so that was good. So the first thing I got, I really wanted some shirts that would kind of transition to the spring. And so the first thing I got was this really pretty, it's actually coming on camera, kind of reddish pink, but it's this beautiful coral color. And it's just a plain pattern. The patterns this year and all the stores are so bold and floral and heavy. I didn't really like them. But then I saw this and thought, I love it. And I had some dark skinny jeans on and it looked really pretty with that. But I also think because it's got white in the outline, that it'll be cute with some white jeans. So perfect to transition from now until spring. And then, I also got this one. When I was headed to the dressing room, I saw this. This was actually on sale for $29.50. It was, mar it was normally $59.50. And then when I was headed to the dressing room, I picked this up. I thought it was so cute. And I came out of the dressing room and like three people were like, that's so cute. Don't you love when people do that? And um, so I got this, it's like navy and white and it's really soft. It's a little bit sheer. So I'm going to have to wear like a cami under it, but I'll actually put it on. But I thought again with dark skinny jeans, it's really light. I even thought for this summer, like if you're at the beach and um, you know, we're going out to dinner, it's a little bit cooler than at the beach. So I thought this would be perfect for that too. So I'm going to try these two on and show you and let you see what you think. So I'll be right back. Okay, 
Okay, so I'm back. So here's the shirt. It's like I said, it's a coral. It's coming off much brighter in the video, but it's got the three quarter or the roll up sleeves. And like I said, it looks really nice with like a dark skinny jean. But again, because of the white pattern in it, I think it's gonna look really good with white jeans. So let me try on the other shirt for you and see what you think. Okay, so I'm back. This is the navy and white shirt that I was talking about. It's just, don't you love the pattern? I think it's so cute. But it just falls at the right level. I have dark, dark skinny jeans on. And it's just super comfortable. I rolled up the sleeves a little bit to give it a little more style. But it's super soft and easy to wear. And I think if I brighten up my lipstick a little bit better, I won't look so pale. But anyway, really like it. So between the two shirts, I think one was on sale and I had a gift card from Christmas. I paid $45. So I think I did pretty well there. Anyway, tell me what you think of my haul. What do you like out of everything I bought? Um, if you have any lush, lush bath bombs that you're in love with, please let me know because I already know I'm going to be addicted. And um, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up and hit the notification bell so you can see my future videos. And I'll talk to you later. Thanks. Bye.